What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Cool with Cool Kicks. We are back for another video, guys. In Compton, at the Compton Foot Locker. Um, did get a little dub today. Did get a dub on the dunks. Man, I haven't gotten a dub on, on a Foot Locker raffle in a minute. Maybe their raffles are back to normal. I don't know. But yeah, let's go take a look at these dunks. Let's look around here and let's let's talk. All right, let's grab these dunks. Let's look around and you know, let's see what happens, guys. All right, I did check in. He is gonna give me the dunks. Um, all right, let's purchase them and then, and then we'll look around real quick. All right, I did grab these dunks and yeah, let's take a look at them because I don't even know how these look to be really honest. There's the receipt. Make sure you guys do those surveys. Uh, they do give you a $10 coupon. Can't use it on dunks and releases, but, um, but yeah, these are it. See, this side is just dope. I really like this side. Got the winter camo and then, I don't know, desert camo? That's just fire. This is the other side. I guess that's a jungle camo. I have no clue what that camo is out front. But yeah, it looks all right, it looks all right. I do prefer the left side over the right side right here. But yeah, not bad. All right, that was my size. That was a 10 and a half. Let's start with the Jordan section. And yeah, they pretty much got what most other spots have. Of course, sevens and sevens, PSGs as well as the foot. All right, guys, that's pretty much about the time when the manager came over and told me that I can't take video there. Um, I. I don't understand you guys, I really don't, because it's like a big advertisement, like a big commercial, like, like you know, that gets people to go to that store, so I don't know why they, I don't know why some of them say, hey, I can't film there, what, it is what it is, you know, it's, it's their, it's their store, so it is what it is, but yeah, I, I did see some heat there, I wanted to share with you guys, I did take a couple pictures at least, because they had some dope stuff, they had some dope stuff, and, and, and my favorite thing there were, the Omnis, you guys, they had the Omnis. These are the Omni 2s, the D Browns. These are just sick. Man, um, I, I missed out on these. I kind of kind of wonder if I should have got these. Uh, they did have an eight and a half. Um, I didn't see if they had my size, but I kind of do regret that. Uh, they had these Grant Hills. I had never seen these Grant Hills ever in my life before. So that was hella, hella interesting. Uh, what's that shoe on top of that? I don't even recognize what's on top of that. Probably should have taken a picture, but... Um, I, I was so mad. I, I just need. I just, I just took a few photos, and I, I just, I just jet to be honest. Um, they did have the new Iverson to the latest version of the Iversons. They had the Iverson lows. We've seen that colorway everywhere. I don't really know. Why I took a picture of that. But then in the Nike basketball section, they did have the LeBron. You guys, they did have the LeBron Eight Hardwood Court. These are just fantastic. These are dope. Man, I'm such a fan of these. I am a huge, huge, huge fan. And then they also had these Air Max 90s. I think I'm going to regret not getting these if I don't get these because the Swingman colorway of these Air Max 90s are just hella, hella, hella sweet. But yeah, that th those are the dopest sneakers that they did have. Um, yeah, let's go back to the vlog. Go to Shoe Palace and then let's talk about what they did and didn't have. All right, as I said, they told me I can't take video. Man, I'm starting to hate this place. Should be excited too, because I ended up getting those LeBrons. Should be excited. All right, let's go check out Cheap House across the street, and then, and then we'll talk about these. All right, quick trip across the street, because I gotta, gotta be somewhere. Let's right, see what they got. Damn, they got the fusions here as well. Looks like they restocked at a couple spots, wow. We saw these in Van Nuys, or the Panorama location. Okay, okay, got a couple of mids. Another one of those. Saw these on sale. 100 bucks for these, but they only have smaller sizes, a size seven and a half. Yeah, that's a steal right there, wow. Do got some Air Max 95s. Both of these are fire as hell. Damn, dude, I, I like these 95s. I don't have enough of those. Actually, do I have any? I don't think I have any 95s. Damn, I think I need to get one. Kind of prefer that one. Kind of gives me the 95 neon vibes. Of course, they've had those right there for a while now. Still got the Lakers suede right here. Okay. The Marathon Continues version as well. And they have like five other colorways of these. 
all kinds of suede, man. I've got all kinds of dope stuff. Seen these on sale, 90 bucks for these. Ultra Boost, go for hella cheap, wow. 65 for these? Wow. People in Compton ain't fans of the NMDs, huh? 50 for these? I've never seen NMDs for $50, wow. 70 for these. 50 for these as well, damn. All the Adidas seem to be on sale, well. So seen those for $90, plenty of spots. 90 for these as well. Dang, just half the Adidas boost on sale, wow. Still got these here. Still got these, such a huge fan. Man, someone told me they found a number three, which is freaking fire. Number three, that's dope, dude. All right, that's like a hundred and something. 130 for these, just all the Ultra Boosts on sale, man. No, oh, do you got a human race? Human race one? Okay. Yeah, Pharrell killing it with these. Surprised they're starting to sit because they've always sold out super fast. Man, women's section still got these. Oh my God. That was a six and a half right there. These are eight and a half. Got the Jordan sixes. These sold out everywhere. Air Max 98s, $94 for these. And then $50 for these. Wow, 50 freaking dollars. $50 for Air Max 98s? Wow, wow. 70 for the Michael Johnsons right there. And then regular price. They got a few regular price ones. I believe, yeah, these are all going for 180. And 85 for these. Wow, they got steals, man. They got steals. I guess just not that much foot traffic here. That's crazy. We've seen some of this stuff on sale. These are going for regular price. I think we saw these on sale somewhere, right? And one of the other sheep houses, regular price here. These are going for 80. I think this is the one, we saw this for like 40 or something somewhere. That stuff might be on sale. They might not have changed it in the system. I don't know yet. I was told usually when the price changes, usually it changes at all the sheep palaces. So I don't know, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to test that one day. All right, I do have to get to my next location. We're gonna cut this short. We'll talk when we get home. We're gonna talk about the two pairs that I bought. And yeah, let's, let's go talk about it. Damn, so I did make it out here to Melrose, out in Hollywood. I did have a reservation for a grade school pair at that Foot Locker, but um, yeah, they're closed. They're closed, why? Because this is where the shooting happened. This is the shoe palace right here. Um, I guess you can kind of see a sign. See that shoe palace sign right there. Apparently the shooting happened right here. And they're both closed, you guys, they're both closed. Dang, so we'll have to see. But um, yeah, it looks like that person, or the worker here did pass. Kind of crappy, dude, like dang, dude, that really sucks. All right, let's go home and talk about it. Do got the news companies doing freaking uh, interviews and stuff. All right, guys, that was the two visits to the Compton sneaker shops. Well, kinda, because some of it was vlogs, some of it was not. But yeah, I did pick these up, you guys. Did pick up the Nike Dunk Low SEs. They just called it, I think, multicolor or multi camo, I believe that's what they called it. But yeah, these were it, you guys. So one side is this color. And then the other side is this color. I'm actually a fan of the, this is the left shoe right here. I'm actually a fan of this, the winter camo and the, and the, what is this? The, the desert camo right here. This one has a jungle camo. And then I don't know what the hell this is. Like in what situation do you need orange camo? I, I, just, I just don't see it, you guys, I don't see it. But yeah, these are it. Um, kind of like a canvas material. This is like a sail colorway. This is sale right here, but um, kind of like a nylon canvas, kind of nylon canvas type of material. Um, the rest of it, pretty much like a dunk. Ooh, I didn't even notice. Is that a oh, Nike basketball logo right here? Never even noticed that. But yeah, this is, um, they're not bad. They're not bad, you guys. I I'm a huge fan of this side. Um, I don't know. I don't know if this is a collector's piece or if I'll be wearing it not really sure um materials not too shabby um I, I i do think that this part's gonna crease right here eventually and and we'll see how that looks like after this part creases because it is like that canvas material um 
you know, the, the Nike signs like a, is that a new book or is that a plastic? Looks like a new buck leather. And, and, and not bad, you guys, not bad. So uh, yeah, I was able to get these bad boys. Um, I, that was my first win on flex. I feel like in forever. I think I've had one, one win on flex in the last, uh, what, two months? Two, at least two months. So, um, I don't know if that means flex is getting back to what it used to. I don't know. I don't know. I know what the, uh, Travis Scott fragments. I do know that those went to the highest point earners or those with the highest points. So, um, I don't really know. I don't really know if they're doing that with these GRs. Um, you know, I know this kind of wasn't a GR, but it kind of was because there were a lot. There were a lot. Um, I think there were at least like seven to ten pairs of each size that I saw because I kind of peeked at the, the papers that they had. So uh, there were quite a few of these compared to most of the dunks and whatnot. So, uh, so yeah, I don't, I don't really know exactly how things work or how things are going to work in the future. But we'll see, we'll see, we'll see what these pollens, because I'm definitely gonna go after those this weekend. And then you guys, I did grab these. I don't know if you guys recognize this box. Does have, uh, does have a LeBron as well as a lion on it. And those of you guys that have been watching my channel, I've been talking about these for a cool minute. I've been wondering if I should get them, if I shouldn't, and yeah, I was able to find them, you guys. I was able to find them. I did cop these. These are the hardwood court colorway of the LeBron 8s. And man, the material on these are just ridiculous. Whole lot of suede on them, you guys. And I don't know if you guys can see the suede. It is moving. Feels just so good on hands. Just, just feels so fantastic, you guys. Man, these are just fire. Uh, I swear to God, I think these look better than the Lakers colorway. I think the, I think they just look fantastic. Obviously, the Lakers colorway, you guys did see that for 100 bucks. If I could have found them for 100 I would have been straight. But, yeah, we definitely did not find these for 100 These have been selling out everywhere. So I definitely was happy to get these. Hardwood Classics, this is the old, the OG colorway of the Cavs uniforms. Uh, this is back when Mark Price was on there. I think they did get to the Eastern Finals and then they got whooped on. But uh, but yeah, these are just fire. These are fire. So I'm definitely glad to be able to get these. I did use a $10 gift card. Well, first I used the $10 coupon uh, from those surveys and stuff like that. Then I used the $10 gift card. Then I used the $50 gift card. So I did get almost a discount. Like. You know the gift cards I did get from the flex points and stuff like that. So, um, so that was that was pretty dope. That was pretty dope. But yeah, definitely happy to get these. I'm actually happier to find these than than the dunks. To be really honest, like like I, I like these more. <laughs> I like these more. I was wondering if I should have got the black omnis. I couldn't afford both. I really do like those black omnis, but I have the white ones. So, um, and I, I prefer the, the look of the white ones more than the black ones. The, the white has that little touch of uh, orange on it and whatnot, so I kind of like that. So, um, so yeah, that was it though, that was it. Super, super dope trip. Sorry I couldn't get you guys the footage. Um, it, it just seems like it depends on who films there because, um, you know, the workers that know me, but the manager, uh, you know, she's not a fan. So I don't know what to say. So it is what it is. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Definitely hope you guys enjoyed the video. Definitely did see a decent amount of heat there. Um, you know, hope, let me know what you guys think about these two. Um, you know, 200. That's the going rate for the LeBrons. Uh, a little steep. Uh, what, what, what were these? Like 110, 105? Right, these did run for, what, 110? So uh, kind of a bargain, you know, when you when you talk about collectible sneakers and stuff so thank you so much for all of you who did make it to the end y'all know y'all are my favorite people and and i just so appreciate you guys watching and and hopefully enjoying the videos and yeah so um as usual make sure you help a boy up make sure you press that like button if you're new to the channel go ahead press that subscribe button click on that notification bell you know i do drop a ton of videos i already got a few videos up did hit up another store after this so that should be coming up and and yeah plenty of videos coming you guys see you guys next one peace man i'm tired as hell man i'll go to bed dude oh wait i need to edit this damn